over here would be your radio. You have your Sirius XM, FM, AM, and if I go down, your Android Auto. So everything on the phone. To get out of Android Auto, you can just press home and we're back at the main screen. To get back to Android Auto, you can just tap up here. Excellent. Um, communications, all your contacts, but it's already synced in through uh, Android Auto. Navigation is gonna be for BMW's navigation. You can still use the navigation on your phone as well. So if you plug something on the phone and you get in the car, it'll come up here anyways. Um, but for BMW's navigation, I can press down, press down on where to, and then just fill it out this way. Like target, T, A, R. And the easiest way is always just to use the voice. So all I'd have to do is tap here, take me to target. Take me to target. And let it load. Oh, only because I think because the car is not. Please continue using manual control. That's not the one we want. Okay. So let's try it. Just tap mm -hmm. here. Okay. And then once it beeps, go ahead and talk. Take me home. 3589 South Ocean Boulevard, Palm Beach, Florida. Perfect. Our next destination is 3589 South Ocean Boulevard, Palm Beach, Florida. And there you go. And then to cancel, you just tap on there again and say stop guidance. Stop guidance. I've ended the guidance. There you go. Did you want to store your home address in here? Yes, please. Yeah. So I'll mm -hmm. go over to my destinations, set home address. And then the city is, or what's the city? Palm Beach. Palm Beach? Mm -hmm. So I'll go over to P, A, oh, sorry. Palm Beach. And then the street is South Ocean Boulevard, correct? Correct. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ocean Boulevard. And then the house number. Three five eight nine. Eighty nine. There we go. So now all you have to do is tap there and just say "Take me home." Take me home. Perfect. It will be nice go. to be home. And you can do mm. the same thing again. Stop guidance. Stop guidance. I ended the guidance. There you go. So if I move this back, back again, and I go back to Android Auto, I can also mm -hmm. do navigation on Google Maps. Excellent. Mm -hmm. So again, uh, to use the Google Maps, I'd hold. So if you hold down here, you can use directly from your phone. Okay. Mm -hmm. To get out of this, I can just press home, and again, back to BMW. Excellent. Over to car is gonna be all your settings. So your vehicle status includes your tire pressure, your engine oil level, you can measure that as well. Mm -hmm. Check control in case you get any warning lights or malfunctions. And then required services, this is when all your services do. But as you get closer to like the 10,000 miles, it will just let you know there anyways, right in the middle. Mm -hmm. The settings include the general settings will lead to English, or no, will lead to date and time to standard. The language will lead to English. Now, of course, we can only pick Spanish, French, or Mandarin. Too bad they don't have Russian. I know. <laughs> uh, the personal assistant is the voice command. Units lead to standard. Sound. Now, because you do have the nice sound system, you can change the surround sound, treble, and bass of the speakers. Okay. Uh, and if I go down to touchpad, that's a little controller over here. Mm -hmm. uh, Pop-ups. Again, if you put the car in sport mode, it'll just let you know. Mm-hmm. Focus and fatigue alert. So if you go on road trips, it'll recommend you to stop for coffee once in a while. Yes, yep. When you finish, let me know to put that back in the car. Well, I, I can do it. And this okay, is Valentino with my new car. Yeah. And it's a beautiful, handsome Gini yes. Valentino. <laughs> How often you can go in Bremen and get Valentina and Valentino yes. right here. Yes. Two peas in a pot. Yeah. And one beautiful, brand new 330i. <laughs>
And yeah. right now I would like to ask my genie about this magic car I discovered right here. Yes. This is little magic car, it's calling BMW. Life in plastic is fantastic. Tell me more yes. about So basically this is a, a digital key. Um, once it's activated, you can hold this up to the door handle to unlock and lock the car and then put it in the tray to start the car. Very nice. Did you want to activate it or not? Yes, I yeah. will have to. So all you have to do is just put that in here. And then let's see if it's going to ask me to. I feel like this is a new ship. <laughs> Spaceship. Yeah. Right, a lot of stuff in here. Yes. Let's go ahead and start the car real quick. Just put on the brake. Okay, and push the brake. And then let's see if it's going to ask me to activate it. Yeah, it's going.